What's going on everyone? Vince the Longinia here. Today, we're going to be fertilizing some trees and shrubs, so stay tuned. So this is Arborplex 1445 fertilizer that's meant for trees and shrubs. I picked this up with my own money from Yard Mastery's website, but I did receive some great tips from Sean's Midwest Lawn. I'll leave a link in the description below to the video that I saw where he uses this product. And when I saw it, I told him I, I had to have it. So he pointed me in the direction of where I could get it. I found it on Yard Mastery's website and uh, went and ordered it. And now here it is, we're gonna put it down. It contains 50% slow release nitrogen and some of its benefits are just consistent extended feeding, improved stress tolerance, providing essential micronutrients, improved vigor, uh, promoting root and shoot growth, and reducing transplant stress. Um, so here's a full analysis of the various sources of nitrogen. Uh, this has 4% phosphorus and 5% potassium. Uh, and then plenty of micronutrients, as you can see here, iron, manganese, and zinc. So I know that it's time to fertilize because you, I'm gonna see the buds swelling up like they're ready to pop. And you can see some of these over here, like this is like just about the bloom. So that's about the time when you wanna consider putting down some fertilizer. Now there are a few application methods you can use to apply this product. There's the soil drench method, there's the injection method, and then there's the foliar application method. Today, we're gonna to be using the soil drench method for my tree back here, and the foliar method for my shrubs. So let's get to it. So what we're gonna be doing today is the soil drench method, but here on the bottle you can see they only have instructions for root zone injection and foliar feeding. So I was a little bit um, concerned about that, so I did reach out to BioPro directly to get the soil drench method instructions. And what they did was they sent me a table that basically tells me how much of the diluted solution I would need based on the diameter of my tree. And that's DBH, diameter at breast height. And based on that, I'll mix, for every inch diameter, I'll mix you know, one gallon of the diluted solution into the root system at the base of the tree. So the diluted solution is basically going to be the 160 fluid ounces for every 100 gallons of water, or 1.6 fluid ounces to one gallon of water. So for a tree like this, at breast height, you can see it's mostly all branches. So you can't really take a measurement of the diameter at breast height here. So in that instance, we're gonna be taking the measurement at the base here, which is about five inches. So going back to the table that BioPro sent me, I need one gallon of diluted solution for every inch diameter of the tree. So that means I need five gallons of total solution. And the mixing ratio per gallon of water is 1.6 ounces of Arborplex for every gallon of water. So I need five gallons of water or five gallons of the diluted solution because it's five inches of diameter in the tree. So in total, I'm gonna need eight ounces, that's the 1.6 times the five gallons, eight ounces of Arborplex mixed into five gallons of water that we can then drench around the base of the tree. So let's do it. I'm measuring out the eight ounces I need to make the five gallons of diluted solution. From the table, for trees ranging five to seven inches in diameter at breast height, we need one gallon of diluted solution for every inch of diameter on the tree. So since mine is five inches, I need five gallons of diluted solution. Once we have mixed it all up, we are ready to drench the soil. I'm just lightly going around the base of the tree, drenching the soil. I'm trying to be careful not to dump too much out at one time since I want the solution to penetrate into the soil where I'm pouring it. 
While I'm pouring this out, I'm really interested to know what products or methods you have used for fertilizing your trees and shrubs. Let me know in the comments below. This is actually my first time applying a product like this, so I'm really interested to know what else is out there to fertilize trees and shrubs and how you are using them. Let's keep that conversation going in the chat below. Another thing I gotta address are the shrubs. I also have some shrubs on the side of the house, I'll show you that too. But I'm gonna be using the Petra HD 4000 backpack sprayer to do a foliar application with the Arborplex on all of my shrubs. So the rate for that is two to three quarts per 100 gallons of water. So I'm gonna be using probably, I'll fill this up four gallons. I've got enough shrubs that I think I can cover four gallons. So that conversion factor is basically three quarts is about one ounce per gallon of water. So I'm gonna use four ounces for four gallons of water in the backpack sprayer, and we're gonna just evenly spray everything here. just a few days these things really started to pop here's some more up here and this thing I I thought it was a pretty late bloomer considering that everything else in the neighborhood has pretty much leafed out this is a new tree for us though we had this planted last season at the end of last season so and tree care is relatively new to me so I'm really pleased with the results so far. I'm looking forward to this to continue leafing out and uh, you'll certainly see it in future videos to come. And there you have it. I'll leave a link in the description below to where you can find Arborplex and buy it for yourself. I'll also leave a link to Sean's Midwest Lawn, his YouTube channel, and the video that he did on Arborplex so you can check that out as well. I hope you liked this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and thank you for joining.